Each year, 3.3 million babies die during their first four weeks of life. Hypothermia and infection are among the leading causes of infant mortality, and up to 92% of newborn babies suffer from below normal temperatures during their first 28 days of life. About one in three babies born in India are born clinically low birth weight, and they're at high risk for a number of complications, two of which are hypothermia and infection. And they're born in places where healthcare is not adequate. Infrastructure is poor, the doctors may not have the expertise to treat them, and they often go home earlier than, than we want them to because of financial constraints. Bempu Health is a Bangalore-based medical technology startup aimed at reducing infant mortality through simple innovative tools, such as the Bempu Bracelet. Hypothermia is often considered a silent killer. It's um, not easily detected, especially by parents who are not uh, aware or educated about the importance of temperature in their newborns. Temperature maintenance, I think, is the, more, is the most critical. And unless you get that right, then whatever efforts you do later may not help much. The Bempu bracelet is a first-of-its-kind thermometer that attaches to a newborn's wrist and monitors the baby's body temperature throughout its first four weeks of life. This bracelet emits an audio-visual alarm when the baby's temperature drops below normal. Bempu trains parents to warm their infants through corrective actions, like kangaroo care and swaddling when the alarm goes off. Since 2014, Bempu has protected over 1,500 babies, trained over 300 nurses and doctors, and empowered over 3,000 parents in six countries. I met Ratul at St. Philomena's Hospital when he had come by with this idea of developing a device for measuring temperature. So this device seemed perfect uh, to monitor temperatures at home and uh, alarm the mothers whenever there was hypothermia. So mothers are being uh... Uh, proactive in their care of a newborn as soon as they're getting discharged by taking the Bempu band along with them. The Bempu band is going to remind them to say that my follow-up is there next Tuesday and I'm going to meet not only the doctors, we're going to meet people from the Bempu band. They feel more important, they feel more cared for. That means our follow-up rate was somewhere around 50 to 60 percent. I think now it has reached 70 to 80 percent. Pre-admission rates have significantly come down. I, I don't think we have had any baby who has come back with some problem at least those people who are on the trial with some problems like inadequate weight gain or infections. I see mostly as mothers become more confident with their care. Babies seem to be gaining weight better and mothers are more careful about keeping their babies warm. Kangaroo mother care rates have been very, very phenomenally increased. I think every mother now knows what is kangaroo mother care. We feel so happy because that is also going to foster kind of bonding between the mother and the neonate. Bempu Health is working with state and national governments to ensure the Bempu bracelet is provided to low resource settings at little or no cost to parents. The work we do here at Bempu really aims at empowering doctors, nurses, fathers and mothers to be able to take better care of their newborns and help their babies thrive. Bempu Health is developing devices that will address the actual problems in neonatal and maternal health. It's just a basket full of uh, benefits for the mother and the baby.